Warning this is a comedy satire show. Nothing that we say here should be taken seriously. This show is filmed for entertainment purposes only. By continuing to listen or watch you consent and understand what's about to happen. Enjoy the show. Do scouse women have more fun? <laughs> Welcome back ladies and gentlemen to the White Alex Show. Oh, <laughs> Part one, debate club. In the next 20 minutes, we're going to be debating and discussing do scouts women have more fun? Oh, yes. And this week, oh, ho, 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 it's not a guest. No, no, no. It's an expert on the topic. <laughs> Kay Nicholson. Hello. Yes. Kay, do scouts women have more fun? Let's go. Yes. Okay. That's thank it. you. Thank <laughs> you. Thank you. See you next week. That was amazing. <laughs> Quickest podcast in the history of podcasting. Tell me, why do scouts women have more fun it, than the average English woman? Because we are, quite simply, better than oh, any... Oh, and we lost the seven women that watch this show. <laughs> Four of them posh women. Bye-bye, Karen. See you exactly. next week. Exactly. Like Maureen, not for you. So, <laughs> all the best. Um, we are with a, with, with a different breeze. We're with the a, with a best, best in the business, aren't we? We're just... The business of what? The business of, <laughs> the business of life. <laughs> the, business of, the business of being a woman. Exactly. Okay, good. Exactly. Mo- okay, okay. So, because the thing is, the reason we have this topic is because when I moved here to the UK, mm-hmm. there is a stereotype, which I think is kind of true, that English women are a bit more reserved. They kind of keep their head down, you know, when they're sober, when they're pissed, everyone's crazy <laughs> in this country. That's what I've noticed. But they're a bit more tea and biscuits type of situation. You know yeah. what I'm saying? And when I was in the South, I lived in London in like the area for two years. And I was like, there's something to that. You know what I'm saying? They're like, oh, hello, have a nice day. But then I moved here and I was like, oh, this is what the fuck's happening. The women are crazy, loud. They're like, fucking hell. They're all drunk and stuff. You know what I mean? Handshake women are in the South. Hug women are in the North. Oh, my God, yeah. Because the North, we're more friendly. Mm. Like, and you, you, like, when you say, obviously, like, English women... Scouse women aren't English. Yeah, I forgot that this is the Republic you know of I mean? Liverpool. I'm Scouse, not English. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? You're, That's what it is. You crazy delusional people, you. <laughs> this guy, I love the Scousers, bro. Listen, if they if 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 they give them a vote, Jacob, if somebody gives them a vote, they'll vote this to be like their own country. Oh yeah, we want to be independent. <laughs> the Republic of Liverpool, all day, every day. Yes, <laughs> I love the Scousers. Them, them Southerners, what they done for us? None. They mm. want us to be dead in the water. Mm. But really? obviously, oh my god, fuck yeah. Fucking hell, let's turn this into a politics show. Fuck it, who gives a fuck? Yes. <laughs> All for that. Um, but no, like, we're just, I think um, the comedian uh, Jade Adams, she did a, a bit about this. And it's about, like, because Liverpool is a very working class mm. city. And, and half of the city is on benefits, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I mean, let's be honest. <laughs> it's a working class city with nobody working. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, take your shots and it's started. Let's go, man. Um, <laughs> go on. Sorry. <laughs> no, but, but, you know, we're a very working class city. And the thing is, with working class women, we're just in charge. Mm. And, and Jay doesn't play that brilliant point on one of her specials. We are. And I think that's why we are so loud and, and whatever, because we're in charge. Hmm. Working class homes, the woman's in charge. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She, you know, she's the one. She's the matriarch and she owns it. Because the man is drunk on the couch, isn't it? Because the man is drunk Watching on the couch football. and useless. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Because, I'm sorry, you are useless. Um, I, I'm, are... Not, I'm, I'm from Eastern Europe. What are you talking about? I'm a hardworking man. You're still I'm... a man. Uh, yeah. Hey, 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 hold on. This is a sexy show. What are you doing over here? Hey, I'm the one who's supposed to make fun of women. You don't make fun of men on the And I will make show. fun right back. <laughs> yes, man. I love the energy. Just pew, 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 everybody shooting at each other. Tell me then. Tell me. Why Why do you think it's such a difference? Oh, but do you think it's only in Liverpool women are like that or it's just the North in general? I think it's North. I think, I think Scouse women are, as I said, I think Scouses in general are a different breed. Mm. We are a different breed of people. We're, we just, we have our own way of life you know, a better way of life because we're better than everyone. Jesus, man. We are. Listen. And I will fight that to the death. Listen, we have Patreon on the show. Let's be honest. People in the North have no money. We want people from the South to subscribe. But that's why we have no money because them fuckers up there have have been shafting us for Mm, years. But I want their money. You want their money. The South is lovely. (laughs) Um, It's full of lovely, lovely people. Good. Patreon.com slash Mike Give us some money. You know what I'm saying? That's it. You know? Give okay. us some of your hard-earned money that you've taken off us. Thank you very much. Mm. And the taxes you haven't paid. Really? They don't pay taxes in the South? A lot of them don't, yeah. You oh, think really? we're the scroungers just because a lot of us are on benefits. Mm, they yeah. don't pay their taxes. Yeah. What would you rather have? Someone who doesn't pay the taxes or someone who's on benefits? I'd have someone that's on benefits. They're mm. more fun. Mm, yeah. Because they're not tight. 
People who don't pay the taxes are tight. Yeah, we're not they, cheap in you, this city. Do you mm. know what I mean? The money we get on the dole, we spend on around. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, of course. That's how that works. I mean, yeah, they're free money. <laughs> you don't appreciate free right. money. Of course, you're going to spend it around. I love how this is. Because the thing is, I've been in Liverpool nine years. This is like my home city now. I love it. But why am I being so offensive against the scousers? I don't know. I love it. We're, the, right. we're the best, but like, Obviously, there is that stereotype of us. We're all on benefits and all that. But like, all of my family have always worked. Everyone I've always known, like, mm, yeah, we all work. And I've worked since I was six, fifteen, actually. Yeah. Um, and yeah, I mean, we've always had that. You have that strong work ethic. I mean, obviously, there are always going to be people that take the piss, but you get that in everywhere. You oh, get that in every walk of life. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, mm. It's a natural human instinct to think if we can find a way of of free, yeah, yeah, of f- something for free. Yeah. And and the way the South do it is they. Don't pay the taxes and, mm. and do it that way. So, so this yeah. might be the most controversial thing you ever said on this podcast, by the way. And like I'm we really, made fun of really everybody, we made fun this. of like religion, races. Yeah, I don't care, but hey, listen, don't. I can don't. do that as well if you want. We can, we can, get, we can do that as well. <laughs> but we're supposed to talk about scouts women having more fun. Are we having fun, Jacob? <laughs> okay. I am. Tell me, tell me, why do scouts women have more fun then? I think we have less inhibitions than um, anywhere else. I think. I think we're very. I think, well, most like myself, I think we we do a lot of things for ourselves. Scouts mm. women are scouts women and we're powerful and we're strong. And like... Yes, queen. We, yes, yes, queen. Yes, um, queen. For queen. But yeah, we're just, we're just better. And mm. we know how to drink. We know how to drink properly. Like I've, I lived in London for a short while and like we'd be, I'd be in the pub every Friday and, you know, Susan from the office be like oh, I've had three glasses of wine I'm pissed oh, oh, oh. and then there's me on my third bottle like I'm fucking sound <laughs> like we we just it's like ingrained in us we know how to bevy we know how to bevy do you I've know seen, what I mean? I've seen a lot of scars from just like on the pavement past <laughs> like four o'clock in the afternoon but, but but how much have they had to drink do you know what I mean if they're passed out on the floor <laughs> they've had a lot to drink to make that happen <laughs> and they've packed it into a short time because that's economical or maybe you know I mean? they were not scouts did you check if they were scouts I didn't, I didn't maybe know. they were tourists exactly. maybe they were exactly. students <laughs> yeah. the next time you see an unconscious woman, or woman on the floor go over and just ask her where she's from <laughs> Yeah, Friday. that won't make you like a nonce at all <laughs> <laughs> yeah Check how old she is. Have you got your passport on you, please? Yeah. Check how old she is. Can I then check, check where you're from? from? Yeah, man. Here you go. Yeah, so you, you, get, you get age and location. Here That'd you be absolutely stunning. You Liverpool, I'm on your side now. Yeah. I'm, I'm back. I'm a good guy now. I used to be a shield. used to be a bad guy in the beginning. Now I'm a good guy, bro. I'm back. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Okay, but why Why do, like, I've noticed British people in general, like, why do you like to drink in such a short amount of time? You just want to get pissed. Yes. Uh, like, but why? You want to escape from something? or Yeah, like... the world's shit. Obviously. Did you say the world? The world is shit? Or the world? The wi- Well, the whittle is shit, yeah. <laughs> you don't wanna... I don't think I bevy because the whittle's shit, but, like, of course you want to escape, son. Look, up, look at our government. Look at our life. Of course it's escape, isn't it? But like how you say the... But hold on, when you say the world, you mean your world or the whole... Because, listen, it's a big world out there. The Trust whole me. world. The... <laughs> We're heading Everything towards is shit. doomsday. Everything is shit. The people in Spain, they're having nice tan and fucking on a yacht and yeah. nice food. Have you seen it's our weather? Shit. Have you seen our weather? It's either unbearable heat that we can't cope with or it's pissing down. Mm. Obviously, and either, either weather is good for the bevy, in yeah. my eyes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yeah, that's why we just, we're, we're, a, we're a nation of drinkers and mm. I and I love that about us. Not- very rare thing, very small things I love about this country. Okay, what is it? Name them, list them. The Top week, 17 things you like about this country. Uh, that we can drink. Um, we created Robbie Williams. Um, uh, Robbie Williams? Uh, yeah. Come on, love, Robbie, Robbie, love Robbie Williams. Really? Yeah. Oh, he's, he's, he's amazing. So hold on. You had Freddie Mercury and Elton John, ACDC, uh, Rolling Stones, and you're going to th- beat us. And you're going to be for Robbie Williams? <laughs> yeah. What the fuck? Uh, Robbie, l- listen, if you're watching, is this my camera? Robbie, yeah. Robbie Williams. Go fuck yourself, guy. No, don't. <laughs> I love you. I love Robbie Williams. Thank you, Jacob. If, what's your favourite song? Angels. Angels. Oh, fuck off. Oh, what? Nah, fuck mainstream shit. No. Fuck off. The no. only time I get excited about Robbie Williams. I love the Beatles. I love that Hey Jude song. <laughs> no. Pick a proper one. <laughs> 
The only time I get excited about Robbie Williams is when I mistake him and I heard Robin Williams, which is my favorite comedian. Yeah. And I was like, oh, Robin Williams. And I was like, ah, oh, fuck, Robbie. It's a documentary <laughs> about Robbie Williams. I've seen Robbie Williams live seven times. And Jeez. he is the greatest showman that explains I have ever a, witnessed. That explains a lot about I, you, love. I, honestly, love, like, I love him. He, no, no. Did you say he is the greatest showman I've of all seen, time? I've ever seen, yeah. I, you've ever seen? Okay, that that's fair enough. <laughs> yes. You probably haven't seen many showmans that far. You haven't seen we me live. We should have just debated this for an hour because I will, I'll defend Robbie Williams, <laughs> the high heavens. It turns from why scouts are having so much fun, fun. to like... Robbie Williams. <laughs> he is not That's why. One. Robbie Williams. I mean, come on. I had scouts woman on and I'm thinking I'm going to be able to manage this conversation. That's not going to fucking happen, let's yeah. be honest. But you got me on. That's Robin the problem. Williams. Not just yeah. a normal scouts woman. Mm. You got me. Robbie absolute Williams. mentor. Jesus Christ. Okay, tell me like a few stories about night out or pissing or like getting oh. pissed or like your mates or something. Do oh, you have any? Oh, God. So many. Um, I've been passed out in the street before. I have. I've Maybe done it was it. you that I saw Maybe them. it was me. <laughs> um, no, I'm quite a... What's quite scary about me is that I'm not a sloppy drunk and I wish that I was because I will get really, really rat ass and then be like, you know when like people do like cocaine? I don't do cocaine for this exact reason. Mm. Because you know when someone does a lot and then they're all of a sudden they're like that? Oh, that's Floating, me when yeah. I'm too drunk. Mm. I get like really like focused on a bad decision. Oh. But because I don't appear to be that drunk, people don't stop me from doing these things because I appear to be with it and coherent. Mm. So I get this thing called the mist. Right. <laughs> Sounds like a cocktail. Like the mist that like, comes over me. Mm. And it's where I become quite, I don't know how to, to phrase it in a good way. The mist. Let's say sexually confident. Yes. Like, Fucking 12 minutes in, finally, bro. <laughs> Let's make this show interesting. Tell us all about it, okay? And I, and I, because cause in my head, and we're all guilty of this. But in my head, and I've done this, it, this, this has only happened since lockdown. Lockdown really fucked me up. I came out mm. of lockdown Everybody, like yeah. a fucking, some, like, as everyone did, but I did come out like a fucking bear seeing the sun for the first time. I was like, that, oh my fucking God, this world. Mm. Um, and, and yet, so I just, like, I'll just go up to lads. And in my head, I'm strutting over like a Victoria's Secret model and I'm mm. like, mm. you're going to buy me a drink. Because you fancy me. When in reality, what I've done is, you're all going to buy me a drink. Because <laughs> you yeah. fancy me. Fuck it out, love. Suck your cock, love. Come like, over here, I'm lad. <laughs> Fuck it out, lad. Hey, hey. Yeah. Come um, over here, it's my good eye. Come over here, lad. Hey. Yeah, literally, yeah. One eye closed. Yeah, you got to come back to mine. And then the thing is, it's literally so sadly true. And then I have this horrible habit as well of... Like promising the world, mm. like I'm like, yeah, let's get back to mine, and then, blah, 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 blah. and then we get back to mine, and within five seconds, I'm asleep, <laughs> and my head's in the toilet. Like that's the like, do you know what I mean? Nice. Like I promise the world, and I, d I don't deliver. <laughs> um, so that's my main issue of a. Of, I've got better recently, I'm better now. It got me in a lot of trouble last year. It got me into a few scrapes. I'll say that for free. Um, scrapes, oh, scrapes. What is that? Like a few scrapes, like scrapes. What does that mean? So when I say like. Um, Got into a few scrapes. How would you? I don't know. Do you, I've you never know, heard of that. You've never heard never of that? Heard. No, never. Shots, I, I don't you know. You get into a few scrapes. I like get into scraps. But yeah, either way, get into F a few scrapes. Scrap no, fight. like Problems? get into a few. Yeah, like a, a few, you know, dodgy situations. Couple okay. of like, you know, like. I like how she's explaining skulls <laughs> slang to pretty much to foreigners because he's from the. Where are you from? You're from the north. Nottingham. Not, Nottingham. Is that? Midlands. Uh, Midlands. Okay, yeah, yeah. Pretty much. We're foreign uh, for you. We're, we're both uh, we're foreign. <laughs> he's more foreign than me, by the way, for you, probably. He's like, yeah, ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Nottingham. Yeah. <laughs> oh. More division between Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh, He's from Eastern Europe. We should have had Brexit from Liverpool and everywhere else. I definitely would have voted leave then. Um, <laughs> But, okay, okay, but yeah. tell me, you wanna go into details then? This is 18 plus show, it's fine. <laughs> <laughs> um oh, I've just had some. But we have a lot of Christians stories. watching, so be careful, okay? A lot of Christians. Christians, yeah, don't use the Jesus name in vain or whatever. I've got a lot of things to say about God Come at the on. minute. No, 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 let's go back to you getting in trouble. Come on, we got five minutes left. This? this is all over the place, Jacob. What's happening? Fuck it out, man. They're That's the why we don't have women on the show. That's why we don't have women on the show. Now, Jack, we love the women. We love the women. Yeah, because you came out of one. Remember yeah, that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. My, okay. missus, my missus will beat me up if I say otherwise. So, yeah, we Good. love the women. She'll have to get in line. I'll have to She's Polish, fish. by the way. If She's you Polish. Think, yeah, if you think Scouse women are like 
owning the house. Oh, she doesn't fuck about my missus. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. We okay. do. We naturally do. We just we're we're leaders. I think scouse women. Mm. We're leaders. I like scouse women because they because yeah. they're loud and funny. Yeah, That's and, and we like. we don't take ourselves too seriously. Mm. We're very yeah. We just I think we 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 live for kind of. This sounds dead cheesy, but we live for the moment. <laughs> um, but we, we, we do. We, we, you're like we, working class white girls because you do have the live, love, spirituality, but you're kind of like, Woo! but you are after work getting pissed and get into a fight outside of a bar. Yeah. I've never gotten into a fight mm. because I'm very loving when I'm pissed. Mm. I'm very, um, yeah, I'm not an angry drunk at all. I'm a very like lovey dovey person when I'm pissed. So about those crabs then? Say again. About the crabs, on. Yeah. Come on, we have four Actually, minutes. Actually, Let's Actually, finish on the bang. Do you know what? Mm. Actually, on Friday, I got a text. I'm officially STI free. Okay, so oh, hey, hey, hey. <laughs> the, uh, Yay for me! <laughs> Yay! They have a celebration party in Liverpool in the summer. I don't have the HIV yeah. no more. <laughs> I don't have gonorrhea. Yay! <laughs> Fucking hell, Liverpool. I love it. Um, Crazy people. But yeah, we've just got no inhibitions and we, we yeah. I mean, so, don't, don't get me wrong, it's not all Scouse women. There's still some mm. bellends, like, obviously. Bull. So how long are you going to deflect then before you start talking about the little scraps and stuff? Because we have three minutes. Scrapes. Uh, scrapes. scrapes. Yeah, I don't... Get into some scrapes. Okay, get into some trouble. So are you going to share a story or mm. what's happening? Well, Because you brought it up. I, I didn't recently, even know about that one. Well, I but... recently discovered that I was... Um, I had a bit of a fling with this guy and I he I didn't see him for ages. And because I'm an obviously like a... a a nutter mm. and a bit of a narcissist. I was like, he's avoiding me, obviously. Do you know yeah. what I mean? Like, course, he's too yeah, embarrassed yeah, yeah. to see mm, me. Mm. What actually happened? How mental is this? I found out the reason he disappeared was because he fled to Spain <laughs> because he had three grand hit on his head. What? Yeah, because he was in like, because he was apparently drugs running for someone, but keeping the money from like both ends. So basically he was like taking someone's supply and dealing it himself. What? And there's me being like, he's just embarrassed to see me. <laughs> yeah. Now he's fled to Spain what? because someone's going to kill him and break his kneecaps. Yeah. Damn, I'm sure open with Isn't that. Isn't that mental? <laughs> She'll open with that. What are we Isn't doing? Isn't that fucking mental? I was like, oh, so it's not because I'm then now. What the yeah. fuck? What type of like, was it like dr- cocaine or like weed? Or... I haven't got a clue. Mm. I found out from someone else. Oh, really? Yeah, I found out from someone else. I didn't know. I still haven't seen him. Was it like he could be the... dead. I don't know. Yeah, was it in, in the papers or something? No, a fr- a, like a mutual friend of ours told me. Oh, really? What? Yeah, yeah. Was he a Scouser? No. Oh, from Ireland. such a shame. Well, practically a Scouser. He's Irish. Yeah. Um, and we're one and the same. Um, okay. Yeah, I'm a bit of an Irish um, bit of an Irish slag. I'm, um, I'm obsessed with Irish pubs and stuff. <laughs> Irish. That's where you're Irish slag. Oh, I yeah. love me some cock. Oh, <laughs> Turn the morning into you. Turn the morning into you. Turn the morning into you. I actually, I've been doing this a lot recently Amazing. as well. I keep, when I'm drunk, I keep trying to convince people that I'm from Ireland. Mm. Like, I keep doing this thing where I'm trying to convince Irish people that I am also from Ireland. Mm. Um, which is which part fucking of Ireland stupid. I always say I'm from Derry. Derry, okay. I say, yeah, from Derry. Because I feel like if you say Belfast or Dublin, it's a bit too obvious. So I'm like, no, I'm from Derry. Derry. Yeah. So do they usually say, oh, really? Like, start a yeah. conversation? They're like, nah, you're so not So I was from like, where about from Derry are you from? Mm-hmm. And I'm like, oh, I'm from... Blah, blah, blah. It would be funny if she opened Google Maps, like 20, <laughs> just one street, she just saw one no, street. No, I was talking to this fellow once, yeah. and he was like, where about from Derry are you from? And I went, <laughs> do you know by the school? That's a bad accent, I do better than that. I said, do you know by the school? And he was like, yeah. And I was like, yeah, by, this, by there. And he was like, oh, I know. And I was like, Swan God, I mean, that one, that like, fucking hell. <laughs> he was very clearly blasted enough as cake, yeah, but still it works. One, they have one school Lift and one church. Apparently. Yeah, one like, school yeah, and church. From there, yeah. What? Bad in it. <laughs> Jesus, Swan. <laughs> have you ever done it to like non-Irish people or like some foreigners or whatever? Yeah, like, yeah. And they're, they're probably like, yeah, I would believe I, I, I do. I, I, I do have a tendency to just lie and just make up this life. That isn't true. And then it did actually one time I was, I told this fella I was Irish and it went on for ages. But the problem was, is that I ended up getting on really, really well with him. And mm. he was like, can I take you out? And I was yeah. like, no, because I'm going to have to oh, then tell you. Yeah. No, but then I'm going to have to. <laughs> how am I going to explain it? Oh, by the way, I'm not actually Irish. I don't give a fuck. I'd have to fucking keep it going for a whole day. So I couldn't do that. Men don't care. We just want to smash. We don't <laughs> give a fuck. Can, can we be honest? No, we can pretend though we you know who gives a fuck just tell him he, if he yeah, has sense of humour imagine if I was imagine if I did sleep with him and I'd have to do an Irish accent whilst like having sex I'm not that talented no, break character midway 
through. Just be like, I just change. Listen, love. Just you know, change nationality midway through. Fuck it. You can do whatever you want. 2022, who gives a fuck? I told you. I identify as an Irish person. Yeah, who cares? I'm yeah. 25. I'm technically 33, but I'm My 25. My pronouns are leprechaun and fully clever. Thank you very much. Um, <laughs> ah, fuck it. Here we go. We can Because we have a board, by the way, in the other room of all the nationalities we made fun of. Now we can add Ireland as well. But I love, I, I love, I love Ireland. I, mm. I I would love to be Irish. I'd love to live. There. I mean, obviously, yeah. You put Plus, so much effort. I try, I try so hard. <laughs> <laughs> I try so hard to be Irish constantly. All right. So oh. listen, we have Ooh. to wrap up this section. But so we gonna so Jacob's gonna have a verdict. Before that, I'm gonna say do uh, Scouse women and Irish women. Let's just put it out at this point. Do Scouse well, and Irish women have more fun? I think. Yeah. I mean, obviously, and you obviously saying yes, right? Uh, yes, what, I am. What's and your also, verdict, Jacob, Jacob, you know, I'll, I'll beat you up. So, um, <laughs> yeah. is your microphone on? What's your What's your gun off, There's a gun off camera. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what's your verdict? Do uh, Scouse women have more fun? What yes, do you think? I think we've come to that conclusion. You've that been living here for do. a while. Yeah. I've been here six years, and I've seen some crazy shit from Scouse women. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, because we're the best. Mm -hmm. Nice. We love Scouts women. Okay, perfect. Now, <laughs> uh, we wrap up first part with the great. Now, we're going to do part two. Part two is called You Get a Segment. Now, this week you have four segments to choose from. I okay. explained the segments to you of camera. Mm -hmm. Once you make your selection, I'll explain to the audience and then we can dive in. Now, so you have four segments this way, uh, this week. Then the Nightmare. You have Fuck, Mary Kill, Life Swap, or Plan Your Funeral. Kay Nicholson, what do you want to play this week? I want to plan my funeral. Oh, okay. One of my favorites. So this is very simple. We here at the Mechanic Show, we give you a budget, right? And you have to spend it, but you cannot go up or above. Okay. Uh, you cannot go above or under. Mm -hmm. Your budget is a thousand quid mm -hmm. and you have to explain your whole funeral ceremony. Mm -hmm. Go on. So I am obsessed with my own funeral, like mm. in general, uh, because as I said, I'm insane. <laughs> and I love the idea of people mourning over me. Yes, um, same. Because I just think that that's great. And it really upsets me that I'm never going to have my own funeral. Like, part of me wants to get a terminal illness so I can have a funeral and, like, like so I can see it. Um, so... You know funerals happen after you die, right? Yeah, but if I've got a, ter <laughs> but if I've got a terminal illness and I know I'm going to die, I can do a funeral before I die. <laughs> that's a thing. People have done that, yeah? Yeah. Yeah, obviously, I don't a like... A pre-death funeral. Yeah. <laughs> oh, my God, what the fuck? That is going to be the best party ever, <laughs> and I'm not going to be there. Mm. I love when things are about me. <laughs> like, I like obviously, like. <laughs> I didn't even that. know that was a thing. Yeah, <laughs> that's, that's a this. thing. That's a thing. Fuck it out, man. And if I've got a really bad terminal illness, say if I've got like something really, really bad, and like, mm. and I'm still young, and it's really shocking. Robbie Williams will play. <laughs> I knew it. Now, now, boo. Yeah. End this show right now, yeah, Jacob. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fuck this. Yeah. We're not doing this podcast anymore. Hey, Robbie Williams. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. I don't even know his song. I know there was a song of him in a bathtub and it was black and white. Was that, there was like a song. He was in a bathtub and it was all black and white. That was in 2009. That's every video from the 90s. <laughs> Yeah, so fuck him. I don't like him. Go on. Sorry. Well, you're wrong, but okay. Okay, no worries. Um, we'll talk about it on the Patreon. <laughs> yeah. Okay, go on. Um, yeah, to my funeral. So I want to be cremated. That's my first thing. Okay, that's that's. Well, I say okay. this. I also want to donate my body to science. But whatever's left of me, really? I'll get cremated, yeah. Do you think any anything is going to be intact? Because with all that drinking and Irish Liver? accent. No. <laughs> um, <laughs> my kidneys are fucked, so no. Mm -hmm. um, I've got good eyes. Okay. They could probably have my eyes. Um, what else have I got? I've got a cracking pair of boobs, but I don't think anyone would want them. Um, but it depends what what's your illness and depends how old you're going to die. Really, you die that's 90. a really, really fair point, actually. And if you have, oh, like, I hope I'm not that old. Yeah, let's be honest. Uh, you're not living that long. In the, in the words of Robbie Williams, <laughs> I hope I die before I get old. See what I did there? Hey, brought that in, didn't I? Well, I, don't, I don't know the fucking songs. I don't know the references. Fuck it out. Jacob's going to pull up fucking lyrics. Fuck, no, hang on, it's... Jacob's going to pull up fucking lyrics. I want to be old before... Anyway, whatever. Um, but yeah. Um, so I want... I want, like... You know when everyone's like, I want everyone to wear like bright colours and mm. I want it to be a happy day, not a sad day. No, bullshit, okay? My funeral, I want people throwing themselves on my coffin. <laughs> I want people, I want some, I've said, I literally, this is what I want. If you are not all crying, you mm. didn't love me. Really? Like, mm, okay, I okay. want everyone to be absolutely devastated. Like a Spanish soap opera. Yes. Just like flawed. Like fans, yeah, veils. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
Like, fucked up makeup, everything, yeah, you know? Yeah, I want it all. Mm. Do you know what I mean? People on their knees and they're yeah. too old. They cannot get up, so they need fucking help with exactly. canes and shit. There's women with tits out, like sexy dresses and stuff. Yeah. Or you, or, or, or you don't want nobody to be sexy. Actually, no, I don't want anyone to be sexy. Mm. I want everyone to be thinking, oh, I wish um, I'd have had sex with Kay Fush, Dad. So yeah. I don't want anyone yeah. thinking. That Irish like, that's love, what, that Irish yeah, chick, yeah, I yeah. want all of my exes there as well. Oh, really? So Ooh. they can all feel really sad and okay, be like, oh, remember when we like fucked her over and now she's dead? And mm. I'm like, yeah. And then like, you know, uh, well, I mean, I wouldn't be like, yeah, because I'll be dead. But um, I'll have my friends there with pre-planned um, like speeches of what they're going to say. Okay. I'll have written them. Um, so yeah, like vows of the wedding. How much they yeah. love you, how much they miss you. Yeah, yeah, they can dedicate Ooh, their whole life. They could do like a competition of who loves me the most. That'd oh be fun. yes, yes, and with prices. If you want, and they win the my ashes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's really cool. Can I be the host? If you I want, can, yeah, sure. I can be the host. We can do like a little pop quiz, give out shit. We I can do like a that. raffle at the end as well, if you want. Yeah, can raffle. give out stuff. Yeah, and then the money that you raise for the raffle can can go towards whatever illness I had because I'm a giver. Oh, that's so sweet. Okay, so the budget that we give you, that thousand pounds, are you going to use it on like balloons or cakes? Or it's like... going to go all behind the bar. Really? Yeah, so, every single bit of it. So pretty much people, like you have a thousand quid at a tap and people can drink for yeah, free? Yeah, well, I think you... I'm going to, I'll probably use some of it to hire um, like a venue. Mm. Um, I'd quite like the venue to be with like a rooftop. I'd like my funeral oh. to be in the summer. I know that sounds mental. Um, but I just love the idea of everyone having to wear black when it's really, really hot. Um, I just really enjoy the idea of everyone being really uncomfortable and sad. Um, so, yeah, I'd like a rooftop. I'd like a themed cocktail as well. So some money that's to go towards that. Like the, I don't know, the Katini or something. Katini. <laughs> and, and it'd just be, the, the cocktail would just be pure alcohol. It'd be mm. no mixers. Oh, so just um, straight up vodka or yeah, something. Yeah, um, <laughs> just sadness. And mm. um, yeah, that'd be, that'd be it. And as I said, I want like anyone who's ever wronged me to be there so they can feel the wrath of everyone else. Are you going to have like a little, you know, in the comedy movies, how they do a few watching this video, I've died <gasps> and this is my yes. will or like whatever. Are you going to do like a little compilation of yeah. your greatest hits and stuff? What I might do is I might do a load of different recordings and blame a different person for my death in each one <laughs> and then send it to each of them and then be like, it's your fault that I'm dead. And mm. then they kill themselves and then... Jesus Christ. We have a straightener in heaven <laughs> or hell. I'll be in hell. Let's all be real. Mm. If there's an afterlife, I'm well destined for the flames. 100%. Okay. Where do you think is going to be more fun, heaven or hell? Oh. Because both is eternity. And I was thinking you get used to it. If you have <laughs> pizza and ice cream every day for the first three weeks, you'll be like amazing. But then if one year in, if you have three pizzas and three, you know, ice creams a day, then I would rather it doesn't in, feel like I'd rather be in heaven because I don't like the heat. Mm. So the idea of like eternal flames, which is a great atomic kitten song, um, <laughs> I would, I would, I despise that. And also, I feel like I don't know. I feel like I'd, I just, I just enjoy heaven. I love mm. the idea of like just being on a cloud. What is it going to be your heaven then? What's do you think it's personalized heaven? Yes, or is just, I do. Oh, I really do. I think it's. You're very optimistic. You definitely thought about this because I have a lot. Yeah. Of course I have. Yeah, yeah, yeah. God, God is, oh my God, just imagine the bill he's paying, like fucking yeah. making individual heavens for but each this person. Is, do, you know, do you know what I hate, right? <laughs> when someone dies, because I lost my granddad about two and a half years ago. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. I mean, it was two and a half years ago. Still? Um, still dead? <laughs> yeah, he is still dead. <laughs> I mean, it's, it's still Fair sad. enough, he is still dead. Fuck it, I like on this ass four years ago, it gives a fuck yeah, um, for this guy. Oh, he's still dead. <laughs> Love you. Um, oh, but fuck when, <laughs> That's why you're going to hell, by the way. Yeah, like, for for remarks like that. Yeah. <laughs> uh, no, I mean, bless him, I do. I, do, I miss him every day. And um, But I, I, I absolutely hate, like, some of the shite people say when people die. Like, so, like people go, you know what? He's watching over you. Hmm. And I'm like, if heaven's real, my granddad is not going to waste one second yeah. watching over me. Mm, he mm, saw mm. me for 24 years. Mm. Like, he saw me every day for 24 years. If heaven's real, he doesn't give a fuck he's about on, me. He's, yeah. he's off. He's having a ball. He's on that old man Viagra, you know? Yeah, where he's, he having, just he's got the pints yeah. in. He's, he's playing footy with Shankly and Dixie Dean. He's having a ball. He's, he's fucking not asking 20, Yeah, fucking 20-year-olds. Why, why, why in God's name? Would, would he waste his time looking mm. at me going, another bad decision, another bad decision, ah, another bad decision, ah, another ah. bad... Like, no, he's not watching me. He's having a <laughs> fucking ball. And mm. if you are watching me right now, 
get a grip and go and do something. <laughs> hey, hey, lads, subscribe to the Mike Kelly yeah, Show. Yeah. Patreon.com slash Mike Kelly. Granddad, look at me, I'm on a podcast. <laughs> Give us some money. Listen, I know you know G- Jesus and God, you have unlimited money. Give us a few quid, lad. Yeah. Patreon.com slash Mike Kelly. Spread the word in heaven. You know what I'm saying? Come on. You gotta, be, you gotta fucking think business think, all the time. Think, yeah. yeah, come on, show business. You gotta fucking make some money over here. But yeah, you know I, hate, I hate that whole, like, if heaven's real, I'm not wasting any of my time and I'm mm. up there looking down on anyone that I've already seen. Yeah. Like, nah, I'm going to chat to, like, I'm going to JFK and asking him, hey, how do you think you died? With his half of his head, like, just hanging out. No, he's whole now. Do you think that you get whole? Or do you think yeah. you, when you go up and they ask you, do you want to be like a younger version yeah, of yourself? Yeah, I think you pick your age. Ver- I think oh, you pick really? what age you're going to wow. be at, yeah. Like, mm, yeah, that's quite 100%. interesting. Yeah. Can you imagine if he's like a 20 year old or whatever? Oh, I'd be fit. You'll fuck him, don't yeah. you? Yeah. JFK, not my granddad. No, 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 Sorry. JFK, JFK. This like, is not that type of show, okay? <laughs> but yeah, no, oh yeah, I'd shag young JFK. Mm-hmm. Yeah, he was fit. You know, he has, I think, Irish background. Of course he does. No, no, no. He's the, for, he's the first Kennedy's Catholic. Kennedy's Irish. Yeah, Kennedy, Kennedy, yeah. He's the first Catholic president of America. Oh. Joe Biden is the second. So they've only been two out of 44, I think. Only two Catholics out of 44 presidents in America. Yeah. <gasps> Oh, there he is. Nah. Look at that little topless one as well. Oh, sexy. Yeah. Sexy bastard. So, listen, you can do the, the Irish accent. Going to be like, oh, back from the motherland. You know, and he's going to be like, you know, he I'm fucked a Derry. lot. You know, he I'm fucked. From Derry. Yeah, yeah. Where about? Where about? Derry, you know? by the school. <laughs> school. He fucked a lot. You know, we have 10 minutes. Do you want to do one more segment? Or you or you have more to the plan your funeral? Oh, I just, the, the money will go mostly behind the bar. Yeah. I want a massive piss up. That's a very but a sad answer. piss up. Mm. Like I want everyone to be absolutely devastated. But I was also we're quite like a singer there. Um, Let me guess. <laughs> well, we don't have the budget for him though. We don't have the budget for Robbie. <laughs> how about somebody who is like an impersonator or something? How they call cover band <laughs> or something? How about we get a cheap on the down low like for 50 quid? <laughs> you know what? Or, or I film myself doing a set and play it at the funeral. <laughs> As uh, Robbie Williams said? No, I do like I him. Set. I do like him like really sad songs. You know, like, mm. like, um, Hello, darkness, my uh, old they, uh, uh, Then we're going to get sued. We're going to get sued. For that one line. <laughs> no, if you do, you're going to do a set, then we're going to get yeah. fucking sued from everybody. I'll be dead. Yeah, but I have to pay for it. The Mike Kelly <laughs> Show pays for the funeral. We have You're paying for quid. my funeral? Well, yeah. Oh, shit, with a thousand well, quid. Yes, yeah, so I forgot about that. We don't have that much money. Come on. I don't care. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I am not shit. <laughs> Fucking hell. I'm dead. Sorry. Let's not do my one. problem. You want to do one more? <laughs> Let's do one more quick one. You want to do one more quick one? You pick one for me. Go on. So you have Tinder Nightmares. Uh, fuck Mary Kill or plan your funeral. I'm going to say Tinder Nightmares because I want to hear a nightmare story. This is Tinder Nightmare. Um... Tinder nightmares. Anything. It doesn't have to be on Tinder. Everything to do with dating, but we just call it Tinder nightmares. Oh, uh, yeah. I mean, I was once seeing a lad that I met on online dating. It was on Hinge, though, not Tinder. And I was Hinge. seeing him for a while, mm. and I found out he was cheating on me. No. How? No, but, but this is <laughs> fucking the only this was happened to me. I discovered he was cheating on me because I saw him doing a big shop with another girl in Tesco. <gasps> oh, I'd what? rather see him shagging someone else Same. than yeah. watching them yeah. hold hands while picking out juice. Like, that's not okay. <laughs> it was fucking devastating. <laughs> it was Hanover um, Tesco. The, so the big one as well. Oh, big Tesco. That's not even a serious, Metro job. That's serious relationship. Exactly. Type of I took my missus to a big ass though on the first date, you yeah. know? So now we're in a serious relationship. Come on. It's that's... real. Um, oh, and, and yeah, face. it's like sick face, isn't it? Proper, yeah, <laughs> juice aisle. Like, that's it for me. Like, juice aisle. That's how I found out he was cheating on me, was because so I saw him sad. in a juice aisle with him, um, with this other girl, yeah. That's so sad, yeah. You know? What type of juice did you notice? <laughs> <laughs> Didn't notice. Liar's juice, <laughs> <laughs> untrustworthy juice. Um, but yeah, mm, was, so, that, was that your worst date? I mean, dating experience. That's nowhere near. That doesn't even crack my top 10. Oh, we have um, six minutes. Let's go. That's just sure. ridiculous. Let's go. Um, Come on, let's go. I had a date once where I ran away from him um, oh, because he damn. was really boring. Oh, really? Uh, he was, look, as you can tell, I can make conversation with a brick wall. I can mm. talk. For, I can't. I can, oh, I, thank you for the compliment. Yeah, yeah. I, don't, I, don't consider, <laughs> I don't consider myself a brick wall, but I'm trying. No, you know, like, but you know what I mean? Like, I can talk mm. and I can make conversation yeah, yeah, yeah. out of anything. Yeah. And this boy... Oh my fucking God. He was dull as dishwater. I have never known <laughs> anything like it. But because of this, every time I went into a new bar, I was going to the bartenders. I'm on a really bad date. Help me. So they give me like free shots, stronger drinks. <laughs> That's not a help. Wow. <laughs> right. <laughs> so I was blazzed. 
And my mum was on her Christmas night out oh, in wow. the green rooms. You know where the, the green rooms are? It's uh, the top of um, Duke, Duke, Duke Street, I think. Mm-hmm. Um, she was like, it was like a cabaret night or something. And I, we were walking past. <laughs> and as literally as we were walking past, I just went oh, into the green rooms, no. just ran away from this fella. What? And went and crashed my mum's work. So I tell, had a bottle of wine to myself in half an hour. Jesus. Then walked to Largo to meet my niece. Threw up on the way. Still went into Largo. And still to this day, I don't know how I got home. And that was a really bad date. Mm. And then he messaged me the next day saying, where did you go? <laughs> <laughs> and, oh, poor fella. No, he was boring. He what was boring say? as fuck. What did you say when he asked you? Reply. The reply. The reply. No. I said, like, I got kidnapped or something. Ghosted. I got kidnapped. <laughs> Jesus, Jacob. I got kidnapped. Do you at least feel bad for you? Yeah, <laughs> I fucking was going to call the police. <laughs> Crazy, bro. I got kidnapped. Yeah. Eh? I, mean, okay. I, went, I went back to Derry. Um, I went back to Derry. Um, oh, fucking hell. Yeah. I got kidnapped. I'm... <laughs> yeah, run away. Wow. What is the biggest deal breaker for you then on a date? I don't like, as I said before, because I'm not a sloppy drunk. Mm. I can't bear a sloppy drunk. What is a sloppy drunk like, in your opinion then? Someone that's like when they're bevied, they're like falling over and like. I mean, isn't that like, like normal? Come on. I don't like it, and I think it's because because I can handle my ale quite mm. well. If someone else can't, it's a bit off-putting for me. Mm. Um, obviously the normal ones. I don't like Tories. I don't <laughs> like you know normal ones. So, do you know what I mean? Like. My biggest thing, and I know that's so it's so cliche, Go but on. just make me laugh. If you can make me laugh, mm. you've got me. Yeah. That's it, really. <laughs> the normal ones, oh, like stories, you know like how it is. Yeah, 85% of the country, nah, fuck <laughs> Not, <laughs> Your football team's a big one for me as well. Really? Oh, you yeah. watch football? Yeah, I love football. Oh. I'm a massive football fan. Well, I'm not which, like other girls. Which um, team you support? Evan. Oh, really? Oh, that's interesting, because most people support Liverpool, innit? Not if you're from Liverpool, um, but yeah. Really? That's that's a dig. Special uh, on that. Okay. It? What team do you support? Oh, wow. Do you not like football? Any? Not like football? Football's no. too slow for me. What's your sport of choice? Rubik's cubes. <laughs> Virgin. Um... <laughs> Rubik's cubes. <laughs> ah, you embarrassing us over here, Jacob. You touched a woman, Jacob. Um... <laughs> Just sits at home with its little puzzles. You can't hear me. Um... <laughs> You're embarrassing us over here, bro. We uh, have a reputation that we're nerdy on this podcast as it is. I have toys over here. Don't embarrass this podcast. 49 seconds is all I'm saying. Oh, my Wait, fucking... in bed. So... <laughs> I'll that one to you guys. <laughs> Let's do it wanna... at the same time. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Which one can I do faster? Which one? <laughs> <laughs> That's it. We're right. I want this to be the last joke. <laughs> okay. Oh, uh, Jacob and his Rubik's cube. Thanks oh. so much for being here in that camera. You can plug anything you want to plug in. Let's get the fuck out of here. Um, follow me on all of my socials. It's K Nicholson, but with a double Y, so K A Y Y Nicholson. Um, Instagram, Twitter, TikTok. Um, people keep commenting on my TikToks, telling me that women aren't funny. Um, so go and abuse them. Um, saves me having to do it. Um, yeah, and um and everywhere so I'm always around the Liverpool circuit so yeah thank you so much for being here ladies thank you gentlemen. for having me of course always if you enjoy this patreon.com slash mechanic weekly bonus episode and much more I have a podcast with my missus called Rants and Stories with Mrs. follow follow me on social media at mechanic subscribe share tell your grandma whatever you know <laughs> just spread the word and heaven yes oh yes tell them in heaven yes Kay's granddad give us some money lad. love this and uh, <laughs> we need to find a date for Jacob because he is in his fucking <laughs> yeah. Room. Skip. I, I, yeah we need to get you off that roof excuse babe <laughs> see you next week <laughs> see you next week I love you bye <laughs> <laughs>